Welcome back everyone to Pokemon Ash Grey. I'm Yummy Mash and this is part 11. In the last video, I encountered the Squirtle Squad. It was awesome. Uh, one of the Squirtle Squad members though took my Pikachu, so I need to go rescue him. Uh, so the team so far is, regarding I have no Pikachu anymore because Squirtle took him, it's just the regular four guys. Uh, who am I rocking out in the front line right now? Pidgeotto. I'm gonna swap that to Bulbasaur. Just in case I have to fight a Squirtle and Bulbasaur is gonna be super effective with Vine Whip. So let's get back in this cave. I did have a little bit of trouble in the last video finding what I was supposed to do. I went through every inch of the cave and didn't really, uh, well, engage with anything except a few trainers, but here we go. Let's uh, talk to the Squirtle then. Uh, it's just saying Squirtle. <laughs> it's all light blue. It's hard to see. It seems to be saying that it will allow you to give the Pikachu medicine it needs to heal. Only Super Potion will get the job done though. It seems really weak. Oh, poor Pikachu. Okay. I'm going to use a Repel because I don't want to face level 6 Zubats. It's kind of frustrating. They're not exactly high level. They don't give good experience. And they use Confuse Ray. And Confuse Ray drives me insane. Oh, Jesus Christ, Zubat and your Confuse Ray. So, we'll use a Repel. We need to get to that Pokemon now that uh, we encountered in the last video on the outside of the, uh, on the east coast of this cave. Uh, it didn't have a Super Potion before. I would imagine now that it's going to unlock a single Super Potion trigger team because uh, we've unlocked this part of the game. So let's go into this Pokemon Mart and let's uh, try and get myself a Super Potion. Hopefully for free. I'd rather not pay for it. Beat it, punk. Amscray. What? You just need a Super Potion for your hurt Pokemon? Sorry, I just got held up by Team Rocket and lost all my merchandise, so I'm a bit jumpy. You just call me punk. You sound like some rocker biker guy. I didn't manage to save one Super Potion, even though I didn't sell any in the shop before in the last video. I can see it's an emergency, so it's on the house. Awesome! Thank you! Thank you very much. I wish that people not in real life were like that. Oh, I can see you're in an emergency. Okay, this uh, BMX is on the house. <laughs> oh, I would not complain. Man, I'd be so happy. Okay, let's go make our way back to the Squirtle and the Pikachu. It's quite a tender heart on the Squirtle. You you'll see in a sec. Let me just use this for a fact. I, I, I hate encountering Zubats. It slows me down so much. Freaking uh, makes me go off track in, in my mind. If I'm mid sentence and I encounter a Zubat, freaking I just forget what I'm trying to say. It's horrible. Okay, let's go back down here and it's, here we go. There we go. Let's get in the front behind. Oh, yeah. Okay, uh, it seems really weak. Uh, I want to get the, the Super Potion. Yes, please. I don't want to Pikachu dying now. P uh, Pikachu's wounds were healed. He's looking all good. The Squirtle Squad's leader seems impressed with the compassion you had for your Pokemon. It seems to want to join you on your journey. Squirtle join, that's just team. There we go, guys. Our team is beasting it up. There we go. Let's have a little gander. Also, we've got a Squirtle, we've got a Charmander, we've got a Bulbasaur, a Pikachu, a Pidgeotto, and a Butterfree. Man, I have to say, this team looks so damn good. Now, if Ash decided, you know what, I'm going to level up all my Pokemon and evolve them all, how sick would that be having an Ivysaur, a Raichu, a Charizard, a Blastoise, a Pidgeot, and I suppose Butterfree? Pidgeot and Butterfree I'll probably swap out, but these four here, man, if they were all uh, max leveled and uh, evolved, frickin' hell, the team would be so sick. So, so sick. We'll keep Bulbasaur around. I want to get Bulbasaur a bit higher. Okay, now that we've gone through that, we can make our way a bit further in the game. I do like how they don't allow you to get further in the game without Bulbasaur. Uh, I mean, Squirtle. Which I'm very, very, very happy with, because I would have most likely... If I didn't realize that Alderaan thing, which I didn't until I checked off screen, uh, I would have got ended up going through through the game without a Squirtle, most likely. I probably would have thought, you know what, I have to go further in the game to unlock him. That would have been so silly. But here we are, getting a good team on the go. We've got Ash's team from the anime. That is what I like to see. So she's going to finally let us pass now. I would imagine we're going to have to face some trainers. Oh, God, there's a lot of sand here for some reason. What this is about? Okay. I don't want to make it to Vermilion City just yet. I want to just check on the side here. What's this? Uh, Bill's Lighthouse, home of the famous Pokemon researcher. Yes, please. I will go say hello to Bill, without a doubt. Uh, the door's locked. I will ring the doorbell. Who's there? He's like an old man. You say you like to use my phone? Very well. Come on in. Hello, Bill. How's it? Is this supposed to be a lighthouse, uh, Bill? What happened the fuck to you? Where's the upstairs to this lighthouse? There's a phone right over there. Bill, you don't look human, my friend. Uh, where's this phone? This isn't a phone, is it? I'll click it anyway. It's a video telephone. Would you like to dial Professor Oak? Yes, please. Hi, Ash. You caught me cooking dinner. My cook is on vacation. I got to fend for myself until she returns. Oh, yes. You can only carry six Pokemon with you at a time. The rest are all sent here to my lab. Don't worry. I'll take good care of them. I want you to know that my grandson, Gary, has already caught 45 Pokemon. 
the fuck? By the way, Ash, just where are you calling me from anyway? From a lighthouse on top of a cliff? That must be Bill's lighthouse. He's a young Pokemon researcher who knows even more than me. See what you can learn from him. He can teach you just about everything about Pokemon and then some. This is Bill, Professor Oak. Good to hear from you. Hey, Bill. Please give my friend a crash course on Pokemon. I was going to say, please let my friend crash around yours. Well, there's no way I can ignore a crest from the great Professor Oak. I am Bill. No, I'm not a Kabuto. Oh, that's what you are. Okay. I'm Bill, a researcher. This is a costume. I'm stuck inside, inside of it. Could you please help me? Just push the button here. These arms are too short and I couldn't reach it. Uh, yes, I will. Uh, the Kabuto costume set up. And there we go. He's a regular guy. He didn't actually get morphed into an actual Pokemon like in the original Red. Thanks for helping me get out. I've been stuck in that costume for hours. This is a special costume that I use in my research. King inside his skin helps me get inside his head. There are many kinds of extinct Pokemon and I want to understand how they lived. Putting on a costume is one way of trying to figure out what they were like. This planet was created 4.6 billion years ago, damn. During what time all uh, during that time all kinds of Pokemon existed. They had many ways of living, especially the dinosaur Pokemon. In this region alone, there are over 159 species of Pokemon. You're lucky to be a Pokemon trainer. Your goal is to catch all of these Pokemon. That's a great task. Uh, there are only just the Pokemon we know about. There's so many Pokemon have never been discovered. Keep researching. And uh, blah, 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 blah. And uh, he really wants a Dragonite, apparently. Probably the biggest Pokemon ever. Bigger than all the rest, and no one has ever seen it. It's been wandering the world for years and years looking for friends. Some fucking know that Pokemon might come here to meet a friend. It's been seeking for a very long time. I would be so happy to meet that Pokemon. You know, I've always loved how they said, you know what, there's only 150 Pokemon. We have to keep researching to find more. And then it's just like, oh yeah, we just found another 150. It's not like, oh yeah, we found another three Pokemon in the past year from, from sheer luck because they're rare and hard to find. No, they just find a freaking another 150. It's brilliant, isn't it? It's like freaking species on this planet. We don't find a freaking 150 species in a day. Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? I, I highly doubt it. Okay, let's heal up my team then. Uh, actually, I healed up my team like not long ago, did I? I get, I get a bit finger happy. It's so like when I play games, one of the things I do, and it's a really bad habit of mine, is I will save the game two or three times in a row, like straight back to back to back, just because I get paranoid about if it's saved or not properly. Oh, SSN, awesome! Apparently, you don't get HMs in this game. Apparently, you just get items. So, for example, things to cut down trees, you get like some shears or some bullshit. Uh, let's see if we got super potions now. No super potions yet. Okay, whatever. Let's uh, let's keep making our way through this place. Now, regarding Lieutenant Surge, I can, I can go in there straight away. I might do that. I don't know whether we're doing the SSN or doing that first is a good idea. Let's talk to this kid. I wish I could go swimming off of Vermillion's coast, but it's too dangerous. It's much safer to ride a water Pokemon. Hey, why don't you ride your little seal over there? Seal's pretty cool. It's well, better as Dugong Gong Gong. <laughs> oh, hey, I could do this. Awesome. Um, I just get a bad feeling I'm going to lose this one. Maybe I should save it. Let's talk to this girl. Guy. What's this? Another victim for the emergency room? I got Bulbasaur out, right? I wonder what level Pokemon are going to be. Are they going to be in the level 20s here? God, this is going to be a bit of a tough one. Oh, Magnemite. Should have sent out Charmander. It's part of steel, right? No, that's a bad idea. Here's the Leech Seed. Such a brilliant move. Brilliant. I love Leech Seed. I hate Supersonic, but I love Leech Seed. Look at that. Look, it's going to chunk it a little bit. A little bit of a chunk. Nah, it's not too much, but it keeps me freaking, uh, you know, just on edge. And then with the Leech Seed, it's not going to be a status element, so I could even hit a Poison Powder. This Magnemite's going to go down in health so quick, it's unreal. Please hit. Don't hit yourself, Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur, I love you. Oh, man, I didn't know that Poison doesn't affect Magnemite. That, that's, a, that's a big shame. Why is one of my eyes kind of smaller than the other? Let me just, uh... Yeah. This eye's a little smaller. It's odd. Okay, um, what was I going to do? You know what? You know what? Just to save a lot of hassle, let's swap into uh, swap into Charmander. Sonic Boom will do 20. That's not going to one-shot my Charmander. Ah, okay. I'll take two Sonic Booms. That is going to knock out my Charmander. That is a shame. Freaking first. Charmander, I love you. I love you, Charmander. Please, Magnemite, use freaking Thunder Wave and let me hit this Ember on you. Pretty please. I swear to God, I just called that. It's a miracle. Charizard, up, Charmander, hit your Ember. <gasps> this is just going too good for me. Look at that, and a critical hit. That was like perfection. That could not have gone any better. And Charmander's going to get the most of the experience here because he's the lowest level, which I am fine with. Can I send that Voltorb? I will keep Charmander out. I want Charmander to get half the experience here. 
and then I'm gonna swap into a uh, good old Pikachu. I can quite easily go back to the Pokemon Center if need be after these two trainer fights. Just because I want to face Raichu with a full health to Pikachu. I just get the feeling the Raichu is going to be super high level. It's not going to be an easy fight. But uh, let's use the Slam. But, you know, I got my fingers crossed. I think it, it might end up being a... I'm going to get destroyed by Surge, like in the anime. Which, if the case is fine, it's fine. Uh, and then my Pikachu will decide to become Super Saiyan mode. Freaking grow long blonde hair and shoot Kamehameha's at the Raichu and I'll win the, win the fight. Or maybe he'll just, like, learn agility or something. That somehow wins me the fight for some reason. Turn Surge, give me everything I know. You need strict training to even begin to compare to his power. He's a tough guy. Do I have to beat you both for you to take down the uh, the, the, uh, the electric gate? El Elector. Electabuzz. Electabuzz is freaking awesome. Um, let's use Leech Seed. I'm pretty sure Poison Powder is going to work on Electabuzz. May maybe not Magnemite, but Electabuzz, you know, I can see that working. If my Bulbasaur could take this down one-on-one, -on -one, I'm fine with it. I would not mind my Bulbasaur getting the full experience here. I don't have to give all my experience to all my other uh, high-level Pokemon like my Pikachu and my Pidgeotto and even my Butterfree. Which I think Butterfree is only 17 anyway. So there we go, look at that. A Leech Seed followed by a Poison Powder. This Electabuzz is going to lose health so quick. Now I can easily start using the Vine Whips and I, I swear to God, this Electabuzz is going to be gone within three turns. Uh, well, three, well, three turns, yeah, it's a turn. Look at that, look at that, that is beautiful, just beautiful. I've got so much sustain here. That's not going to be effective, which is good, it's a really strong move. Electabuzz has pretty high special attack and very good speed too. I used to teach Psychic on Electabuzz because of his high special attack and it worked out so well for me uh, in my uh, Pokemon Fire Red walkthrough. Used Electabuzz against the Elite Four with the Psychic and the Thunderbolt and I think, it, I, think I had Thunder and Light Screen on him. No, it was Swift and Light Screen, I believe. Worked out great for me. Uh, I actually think this Bulbasaur might faint it, but then I'll just swap into Charmander if need be. Ooh, hello. Hello. I'm a bit paranoid. If my Bulbasaur faints, will they get hit by the poison and then I won't get any experience? I've had that happen before. Alright, whatever. I'll just go for Vine Whip. Bulbasaur's gone. Please don't die by the... I am the luckiest guy in the world. The luckiest guy in the world. Oh, that was like a half an orgasm right there. I'm so happy. <laughs> I don't know why I was singing that, but I really am just so happy right now. You don't have no idea, guys. Lights and different coats flashing on and off. Okay, I'm, I'm such a happy, happy man right now. I need to heal my team. I'm not, I'm not even going to risk it. Approaching Lieutenant Surgeon right, right now might even be best for me to freaking go on the SSN before I even encounter Lieutenant Surge just to get all the experience from the other trainers because Lieutenant Surge is going to be a beast. He's going to freaking throw out a level 30 odd Raichu against me. It's going to be insanely tough. Mark on words, it's going to be like super high level. It's going to be a one on one against my Pikachu. My Pikachu is going to get crushed. It's not much I can do against a freaking Raichu, is there? But it's, it's, it's supposed to happen. You're supposed Ash loses to Lieutenant Surge first time. So you know what? Maybe I'll just Spirit of the Anime. I'll just go for it. How do I uh, take this uh, laser beam down? Okay, there's one. And then this lady will open the second one. And I'm going to have to face him just with my Pikachu. I'm fine with that. Let's do this. You're my next challenger. Okay, baby. Huh? Oh, oh, I call everyone who loses to me baby. You have a Pikachu? <laughs> Why'd you know baby run along a baby Pikachu? Okay, baby, if you want to quit, now is your chance. You want to become a Pokemon Master? You should take your Pokemon to evolve as soon as you catch it. Okay, I guess you'll end up playing with the big boys. Now, have I got Pikachu out or is it Bulbasaur? Uh, do I have to play with Pikachu. Yeah, it's going to be just a super high level Raichu. Look at this. 25 is not as high as I thought it would be. Now, you know what? I'm not going to lose to him on purpose. If I win, I win. That's ridiculously a strong move. I might get crushed by him. Oh my god, Mega, Mega Kick is just such a good move. It's insane. Okay, Pikachu. Shall I, shall I? Should I just go go for it? Shall I go for the Pikachu? Uh, you know what? I, should, I think I should go for Butterfree. I think I should uh, pussy out a little bit. Throw out Butter 3. I know he's got flying, he'll get killed by one attack. But if I can hit a poison powder off, that Mega Kick's gonna just sweep my whole team. This is just gonna be a video of me getting sweeped by this Raichu and sitting here in shock for about 10 seconds before the video fades out. I'm screwed, because Charmander and Squirtle don't really count as much right now. I can use Sand Attacks and lower the accuracy of Mega Kick. That's all I can really do. Please be faster than Raichu.
guys. Guys. This isn't looking good. I can use growl. <laughs> Body slam? This Raichu is ridiculously fast and powerful. I've got no chance. I'm just saving Pikachu right for the end because it's traditional for the enemy to have the Pikachu as the last guy. Um, tail Whip. Come on, Tail Whip. Oh, Squiddle, I'm so sorry, my friend. I am so sorry. This Raichu is insane. Oh, my God. Hey, Ash loses in the anime. What can I do here? I can use a Thunder Wave, right? Yeah, I'll use a Thunder Wave. Okay, that's a good start. Man, this is going to be a close one. Roger is so much higher in stats compared to Pikachu. I could this could be over right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. That just happened. That just freaking happened. He had such a good move set. Oh my god. Body slam, mega kick, thunderbolt. What are you supposed to do against that guy? Oh, and I was supposed to beat him. I thought I was supposed to lose. Oh, I lost 600 bucks. Oh, face palm. Oh, man, I got crushed. Uh, Wait, what did Nurse Joy just say? Oh, 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 it was supposed to happen. I got the Thunderstone. But once it evolves, it can never return to its previous form. Think long and hard before using it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, guys, in the next video, we will uh, do the little uh, Shall Pikachu evolve into a Raichu little cutscene. I think it was embedded all injured. I was like, here's the Thunderstone Pikachu. Wax it away with, a t with his tail. Well, guys, I got just trounced by Lieutenant Surge. That felt terrible. So uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.